I'll start the story from here next time. Bravely I had fought and slain my enemies. Honor and glory were mine. But though I fight until the desert sands themselves were red with blood, I could not bring back the dead. No. No. Those I loved are dead, and I to blame. I choose death.
do not be afraid. This belongs to you. The Dagger of Time? But it is locked away within my father's treasure vault. How- Most people think time is like a river that flows swift and sure in one direction. But I have seen the face of time, and I can tell you, they are wrong. Time is an ocean in a storm. You may wonder who I am and why I say this. Sit down, and I will tell you the tale like none that you have ever heard. No further. I am the son. And that is why I have come. To warn you and your father to arrest this treacherous vizier before he betrays you and brings ruin on us all. His signal is a flaming arrow shot into the air. Prevent him, and my father's army will know the traitor has been unmasked. They will turn back. A wild tale indeed. I have a simpler version. A Persian soldier lusting for glory entered the chambers of the Maharaja's daughter and was slain by me. Your Highness, for your own safety, I suggest you flee. I will handle this intruder. Matrudevate Apati! What sorcery is this? Stop this at once! Oh, my lady, he came here to abduct you. Surely you do not believe him. He will betray you! All will happen as I have foretold. Do not forget, he's a Persian soldier. What I told you is no story. It happened. I mean... It will happen. Father and son are alike. It would appear that both shared a taste for easy plunder. You waste your breath. Did you really think you could defeat me? <coughs> Careful. Don't tire yourself. He became a party.
finds his only daughter slain by the son of his enemy. Do you have any last words you wish me to communicate to the princess before I kill her? Words of love, perhaps? a traitor. Take this. Return it to your father's treasure vault. Guard it well. I owe you thanks. But why did you invent such a fantastic story? Do you think me a child that I would believe such nonsense? <gasps> I said I owe you thanks. You presume too much. Story. Do you think me a child that I would believe such nonsense? You're right. It was just a story. Wait! I don't even know your name. Just call me Kakulukia. <laughs> 